In this video, we'll look at the ERCP filament buffer, why you needed it for multi-material printing, and how it works. In your multi-material print setup such as ERCF, each material is sent through the MMU unit, through this PTF heat tube, all the way to the extruder. So that's a pretty long length, and when you swap the material, all of the material will wind back to the spool. So I'll show you how that unwinding looks like on this uh, normal filament holder. Now filament swap command is initiated. You can see the filament start to unwind. And uh, here is all the spool looks like. You can start to see how messy it gets. Then it moved to the next color, then fill to the extruder. So all this filament hanging out here could be a huge potential problem. It could get caught easily on surrounding objects, and uh, in this case, this would be a knot that will definitely stop your printing. So the filament buffer is a solution for this problem. This filament is set on a ERCP filament buffer in Ridge Rabbit carrot patch. Let's see how that works in action. So the geometry here forms as a cage, so all the filament will stay in place when unwinding. And when it needs to be loaded, this wheel actually as a buffer wheel that would keep everything uh, hold up tight. If you like the content, don't forget to subscribe for more 3D printing stuff. We'll see you next time.